We're pinheads now. Oh man, I'm hurting. Just got a, an x ray done. We had the pitching machine tonight. Uh, I fouled one off my foot. Oh, the pain. I played baseball for six years. All right. Until I was 22. I never hurt myself like I did tonight. It really sucks being old. All right. Um, so I decided to go to urgent care. And I had a sinus infection. So I thought I was going anyway. I'll check this out. Ladies in there. All right. So they already have the snow blowers out, guys. You know, we talked about these last time I was here. Um, looks like they probably sold a good five of them in the past two weeks. Because if you remember, I mean, there was probably, wait, what, one, two, three, just three rows. There was no, they had to sell probably 10 easily. All right. So they're kind of winding these down, which is good. But they still have a lot here. Um, this one has the bagging system on it. But we already got the blowers out here. I don't know why it's so dark. I guess it is dark. All right, let's get inside. I wasn't going to spend too much time. And uh, I'm hooked up to their network. So I don't, I don't know how the reception will be. They're still selling this thing. These, um, these aren't that good, guys. Uh, I believe this is a 28 inch. It's 749. It was 799. Man, it's so dark. Listen, if you're looking for something like this, you know, 28, 30 inch, really look at the Toro Time Master. Um, it's a really nice unit that's um, proven itself over the past six, seven years. Um, MTD makes that Craftsman. It's available in a Craftsman. It's in, available as a Troy built, and it's available as a Cub Cadet. So one, they're just painted different colors. All right. So let's um, let's get inside. And look at this. That, that's that's very nice. Welcome, veterans. See, that's what I like to see. We're pinheads now. All right, so I got some nice stuff going on here. I have to come here. Sealant is out everywhere. I do it every year. I usually start buying them as soon as they put them out. I already bought probably around 10 4.75 gallon uh, canisters, but I, I, I need more. And Home Depot sold out. Every Home Depot sold out. So I don't really like using the low stuff, but unfortunately, they're the only ones that have it in stock here. Um, but we'll take a look here. Hope the reception, how's the reception? It's probably not good. Slavic, how's the reception, buddy? It looks like it could be pretty good, I don't know. All right, what's this? No, I don't really like that. All right, so they got some Craftsman stuff here. Again, this really, um, you know, look, $25, guys. We, we saw some of these. Now, this is drill bits, but, we, you know, we just saw a black oxide set. I think it's 21 piece. Now, this is titanium, but still, uh, I don't know. I don't think you're getting a lot of value there. That's pretty good. All right, thanks, buddy. 15 bucks. I mean, this ain't bad. Uh, yeah, see, this is pretty good. Actually, this is really nice, guys. Because you do get a pouch. And, you know, you got some safety torques, it looks like, in here. Yep, you do. All right? Um, so that's 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 great. No, actually, they're, they're just small uh, tees. I don't see the holes. But it's still, you know, it's a nice set. It's hard to find those safety sets in store. You kind of have to get them online, those uh, security torques. Um, bits, but all right, I'm not gonna go too crazy tonight, guys. Um, I doubt they have any of those mowers left. A lot of snow blowers. Here's a Honda self propel, I mean, um, single stage. Wow, look at this. So, these are some nice units here. 
Well, they got that. See, this Arians is one of the best single stage out there. This is made uh, really for commercial use, guys. This is that um, Arians. It's pretty expensive, though. Um, I think it's, I don't see the price on it. It even has an hour meter. Wow, that is so awesome, guys. Made in the USA. This is a great single stage unit, guys. If you're looking for a single stage um, snowblower, uh, I really, really, I wish I knew the price of this. They're not cheap. I want to say this is probably around 600 bucks. But um, I think for what you get and the durability of it, you know, like I said, they kind of advertise this for the commercial um, snow blowing. But these guys looking at weed whackers. All right, let's look at the tools here. Let's go over. But yeah, so obviously a lot of winter stuff, right? We're getting rid of, even though it's been like in the 90s every day. Um, which is really incredible, guys. I mean, I can't believe it. And we have gotten like no rain. All right, no rain. All right, I still got these kits for 99 bucks, guys. Um, you know, the blower, you gotta remember, you get a four amp hour battery with this. So that's like a $50 battery. So if you need or you want maybe an extra battery and an extra charger, I mean, 99 bucks um, doesn't look like they're selling too good, but you know, 100 miles per hour, 410. Um, so it's pretty much like the Dewalt. It's actually a little bit better. Remember, the Dewalt is 90 miles an hour, 400 CFM. So, you know, the issue with this, I think the biggest battery to have is a six. Um, so, but you know, you get a, a, you can get an impact, guys, with a two. And remember, there's some speed settings with these. All right. Personally, I would go with the, I'd spend the extra 30 bucks and get the rigid, all right? But very similar, okay? You do got some speed speed settings, uh, a selector, all right? If you had that, this is what you kind of want. Uh, I think it has three speeds. Remember, the rigid has six. Um, well, they got the outer box here. So they're actually, wow. They're making uh, coolers now, OtterBox. Let me tell you, they make the best telephone, uh, cell phone. What's up, buddy? Yeah, it's dead. Thank you, APEC. Yeah, guys, and uh, the website, I got someone kind of working on it. Um, one of you guys, uh, you know, has is into, you know, websites. He does websites, and um, he's really gonna get a lot of good information on the the new toolballs website it's, it's, it's the same you know toolballs 44.net but hopefully every day we're gonna have some new stuff on there for you all right we're getting to the tool i'm sorry it took eight minutes to get over here i do apologize but all right so the place is dead guys as usual and um this is one of the slowest lows I'm at tonight. This is the one that's always lows. And right here is usually where I drop reception. They still have two. Wow, guys, it dropped. It dropped. All right, everybody has to calm down. If you don't calm down, I'm walking out of here. Because, you know, you can tell I'm a little. My, my foot is killing me. Now, Steven Federer is going to see this. He spent 349 on this when it came out. We got it. He bought it, I believe, at 249. Okay. He thought it was the deal of the century. I'm like, all right, chill out. Went down to 229. He went. They took the price off. All right. Then it went down to 199. He's like, boss, should I go back to Lowe's? I'm like, yeah, go back. So 249. He got it price dropped twice, and then it dropped to 179. He did it again three times. Three, three, I said three, he did it three times. Now we're down to 149, guys. All right, I have the Milwaukee, guys. This is not built like the Milwaukee, all right? Uh, you can tell just by looking at it, but I've seen it put together because they had one at that one store. 
and it's not, I mean, $149, guys. Um, you know, you don't have to put this one up, this shelf, I guess. I'm just taking a look at it. You know, since I put mine together, you probably don't have to put this. So if you want more room under here, I mean, it's up to you. You know, my man Federer has some wrenches, the magnetic wrenches he's kind of has on this side here. But it looks, you know, it's it's not bad, guys. Um, it doesn't have a, a one of those lids on it. Um, but remember, you get 141 piece, um, you know, mechanics tool set, quarter inch and three eighths. And I think there's even half inch stuff in here. Um, they're pro 90 set guys, 149 bucks. I mean, who wants it? I should really walk out with this right now. And, um, I might do it just, I'm really just might do it. I look at this for 329 a little workbench here. You know, I'm, I'm going to be honest with you, 329 is actually a really good price for this. If you look at some of these um, workbenches, now I always recommend build your own. Mine is probably double the size of this. And I think I made it, and when I did it, you know, the video is probably five years old. It's one of the first videos I did. Ooh, excuse me. I got some uh, pizza pie uh, coming up on me. A little acid reflux. But I think I made it for like $90, all right? But when you look at some of the prices of some of these benches, guys, 329 you know, it's not that big. But, you know, you got two drawers with it. All right? It's, you get two drawers. You got a, a, a wood top. I think there's like a light. You got a pegboard. I don't know if this is a light or what. What's going on here? Oh, this opens up. Oh, so you got some store. Oh, look at this, guys. You got two of these. Um, yeah. So you can put, you know some you know whatever your oils your wd-40 maybe some spray paint or whatnot up here i tell you 329 and it's, it's kind of kind of cool looking you even got some peg peg boards on the side some peg holes i mean i mean listen hold off don't be surprised this drops down to like 279 at 279 you know something to think about these are down to 50 bucks uh you know yeah, this stuff is going crazy, guys. Everybody's talking about this AWP stuff. Everybody likes it. You know, they're known for their knee pads and stuff. Um, Lowe's is really carrying a lot of their stuff now. Um, yeah, guys, again, $149. If you're interested, let me know, and we'll pick it up for you. We'll send it right over to you. I mean, all right. Uh, Milwaukee's sending me some of their new gloves. Uh, I think they're impact gloves they're going to send me. And we'll take a look at them. I did buy a level three just for giggles, you know. But we'll have to check that out when we get them. So it looks like they got a couple new cry. I don't think I've ever seen this craftsman box. I'll tell you guys, like I said, I, I did a video on it. If you're into this stuff, listen, I'm going to be honest. The craftsman boxes, they're a little bit better. All right, and then they're only really better because they have that seal. But besides that, they're, they're just a different color. These will work. They will attach to your DeWalt. So they are, um, yeah, these will work. They, they will, every every Veristack box will work with the DeWalt uh, T-Stack. But there's a really good deal I did yesterday at Home Depot. Um, they're running a deal where you get the two. Now remember, this is thirty-five bucks alone. Okay, so you get this, this, this as a Dewalt. All right, so just pretend this is yellow and this is black. You're gonna get this for, and this is for fifty-nine dollars. All right, you're gonna get this box. You got the two drawers here. Okay, you're gonna get this box right here. This is twenty-five bucks. All right, you're gonna get this. This is what it's gonna look like. Now remember, it's just you got yellow instead of the red, and then where's their big box? They don't have the big box, but you're gonna get the big box. I think the big box might be on the other side. All right, fifty-nine bucks, guys. So you're spending twenty-five and thirty-five, right, dear? You're at like fifty, sixty dollars, right? All right. So you're pretty much getting the big box for free. All right. If you don't mind it being yellow instead of red. Again, there's the one thing you don't get is this little seal. But, you know, you'll be all right. Okay. They got the Irwin clamps here. Um, 
I tell you, it's crazy with the uh, work. Um, I'm kind of setting up slowly the Milwaukee tool cart, and man, does it fill up quick. Here's the Craftsman, 17 bucks. You know, hopefully we're going to start seeing the USA, USA made stuff, but remember this was all cobalt. Remember, just six months ago. So Craftsman has officially taken over. And I don't know, guys, if, the, if it's selling good or not. I know Cobalt really had a big following, and I didn't really know how big of, of a following they had until the switch over. Because I see the comments, oh, I'm kind of pissed. I like the Cobalt stuff. I like the Cobalt. I can't believe they did this to Cobalt. Cobalt is gone in my store. So this is what it's really down to in this store. It used to be nine, ten uh, display bays. We're down to two here. All right. But they do kind of have everything that you need. And again, if I see anything online, these a lot of these big 100 piece, 227 piece, 300 piece mechanics tool sets are practically, oh, look at this. They're practically giving them away. Oh, look at this, guys. This is a good deal. 219, guys. So we saw the, um, the Ryobi. Okay, the Ryobi was 169, I believe, but I, I think that was like a used. I don't know what was up with that one, but it's usually 199. Okay, so you can get the Ryobi sliding for you know 20 and 20 dollars less, but I don't know if it's 15 amp or 12 amp that Ryobi, but pretty similar. I, I definitely you know if you want to go with the Craftsman. Um, you know, not a bad idea for that. You know, 10 inch sliding miter saw, it's a good price. Um, this is this stuff. I don't know, man. Just, I mean, they got this all loaded up with just brush tools. And I just don't, I don't, I mean, I just don't know if anyone's interested in brush tools anymore, right? I hate to say it. And, you know, I, we, we talk about it here, right? You know, we know the advantages, right? A little bit better runtime. The, the tool will last uh, longer, right? A little bit more, you know, initial torque, right? You know, a little bit better if it gets wet, right? Um, so that that's really the advantages to it. But they have three brushless tools. And they, they, they got this line big really quick, all right? Because really, it's really just the wall and porter cable stuff that's red. So they were able to kind of get this big platform out within like a year, right guys? Maybe a year and a half. They got a lot of tools here now. I mean, everything. They even got the radio over there, the DeWalt. Remember, it's all just really DeWalt stuff, guys. I hate to say it, all right? They need to get some brushless stuff out, Craftsman. And I think if they do, um, I think you maybe start seeing some better some better feedback, let's just say, right? What do we got here? Table saw for one night. This is a good deal, guys. Wow, and you get the stand. All right, so, all right, Lowe's. I've seen a couple deals here already um, that I, I, I kind of like here. And you know, we definitely saw that cobalt deal for 149 Wow. Del Rio likes the brush. Yeah, I mean, if you like them, go nuts, man. Um, definitely nothing wrong with them. Um, it's just, you know, they're, it's old tech, you know, I don't know. It's just, um, anyway, wow, what's this, 159? Oh, it's a Shopmaster. All right, so we kind of talked about, this is a 10-inch portable cobalt for 279. A lot of people are talking about this. They've been asking me about it. I'm telling you, the Craftsman here, it's a 10-inch. You get um, the stand with it, 90-degree max cutting depth, 3 and 1 8 and 45-degree at 2 and a quarter. You know, for 199 guys, that's a pretty darn good price. All right, you know, pretty much at the wall. You know, I mean, um, this a lot of people like this. So I'm not gonna, you know, if you, you know, for 279, I mean, and I did one on the Delta, and that was a really good price too. I don't think they have it in store. Here's the Metabo. I don't know what the price is. And they got the Bosch chair. This thing's probably like 600 bucks or so. All right. So, and remember, if you're looking for um, 
that rigid stand. Should be, yeah, there, there it is. Oh, they even have a power source. 22 bucks. All right, you only get one USB. Are you serious? What are you doing, craftsman? Craftsman, what are you doing with one? How's the reception? That's terrible. What's up, Ken? I appreciate that, buddy. Eric, what's up? Good seeing you. Melger, what's up? Apex in the house, Tony. Lawnmower. Yeah, right, lawnmower? I mean, 149, guys. You know what it is, too? It, it, it would make it great because it makes it look like you're spending a lot on somebody. You know, you kind of, you know, you give your nephew that tool car with all the tools in it. He's going to think you spent like three, four $400 on it. So um, check your lows and, you know, see what happens. All right. Wow. The Cobalt fan down to 69 bucks. Listen, um, some of this stuff is well priced some of it isn't you know 69 bucks you can get the dewalt for 90 right at home depot with the battery um but and here's their brushless miter i think this is yeah this is dual bevel so this is not a bad seven and a quarter in saw guys uh don't be afraid definitely you know to remember the craftsman is only a single bevel um i don't know what's going on with this stuff it looks like they kind of yeah all right so what do we got here? Oh, right, you can get a free two. Is the vacuum on here? No. And again, they got a very big line. They really have anything, ever everything. All right, so guys, if you're looking for this, if you buy this right now for two sixty nine, you get a free two. I think this is bare tool, right? Yeah, tool only. So it's 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 pretty expensive um, compared to the Craftsman, but. Anyway, the vac is on here. Oh, you, wait, even buy one. So if you buy the power source, that's crazy. So check this out, guys. Whoa, what's going on? All right, everybody back up. Beep, 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 beep. If I spend $19.99 on this power source, buy one select cobalt 20 right there man so if I buy this for twenty dollars grab it too what grab it too man uh, you uh, talking to me sir grab it too uh, I, I don't really understand what well, you getting that yeah I'm thinking about buying this uh, power source yeah oh yeah you get a free two with that no way so guys hmm I love these boxes too. Probably one of the best organized boxes are these cobalt uh, bit sets. The bits aren't that great. You know, they're not bad. But I love how much stuff. I have this one. It's about the same size as this. And it has four sockets in it too. Uh, four, three, eight sockets. And I think it's like a 75 piece. And let me tell you, man, it has everything in it. You know, it's not, not the best, but. All right, so if I buy that. Yeah, if you buy the impact wrench too, that's weird that they're gonna give me. So I mean, what's the, I get? It's yeah, it's not a bad deal. Oh look, they're doing it. Oh, they're giving these away, guys. All right, so listen, get down to your local Lowe's. Now they have these little pegboards up with some deals. These are usually six dollars a piece. They're down to two bucks. All right. This is their T30. I don't like the T, I like the T25. So are they all T30? I bought the long ones. I really like them. I used it. It's square two. No, get rid of the square two. Here's a square one and a square two. All right. Yeah, these are good. This is the one I got. I bought this. It's pretty good. Oh, look at this for eight nine. Wow, this was guys. Check the ones. Only one left. Eight ninety eight. It was. It's down from twenty bucks. This is your mortar knife, right? Yeah, this is great for your new SDS. We're going to take a look at that because I put that. Oh, look at this, guys, for six. I only, they only took a dollar off of this. So, yeah, guys, if you're interested, they got some Linux stuff. Wow, these, these are two dollars down here. Let 
what it is. Yeah. Yeah, here's your T20. See, but they make they charge you three dollars. They charge you an extra dollar for the T25. All right, and you got the torsion zone, okay? These are okay. You know, I, I, I like the Bosch bits. I really do. Oh, these are down to... I bought mine for five bucks. They got ripped off. Nineteen ninety-eight. That's the regular price. I paid five bucks, all right? And I think, yeah, I have the 40 tooth or the 60 tooth. But yeah, they got these bits, guys. If you like the Bosch bits, two bucks. And they got some nozzles. All right, check this out, guys. Wow, 22. You get a hose here. What's this? 269. See, I'm, I'm waiting until they have the Metabo stuff here. What do we got? All right, we're kind of moving around. All right, what do we get here? They got the DeWalt vacuum. I forget the company that makes these. Oh, wait. Right there. All right, so this is just the licensed DeWalt tool. All right, a different company makes this, just like my DeWalt shoes that I love so much. They just say, hey, man, we know DeWalt. A lot of people love DeWalt. Can we just use your logo and trademark, and we're going to put it on a vacuum? Yeah, go ahead. Give us uh, 35%. All right, you got it, buddy. All right, so this is what I was talking about, guys, yesterday. This is what I, I feel like, you know, see how empty it is? I feel like just knocking stuff over. You see this whole display here? I'm really thinking about just knocking it right down. Yeah, because it's it's terrible. All right, so we we saw these yesterday over at Home Depot, right? Same black case, you know. Remember, at Home Depot, they're called the Max Fit. Here, they're called the Flex Torque. They got they thirty fifteen dollars. They want twenty five, but thirty four dollars. Not on sale. They want thirty four dollars. They're fifteen dollars. Here's your 21 piece black oxide, right? It's $14 at Home Depot. Come on, guys. That's why I can't. Because, yeah, they're shady. Look at these prices. All right, what do we got here? Yeah, this is. Um, I was telling people this is the difference, guys, with the XR. You get. Uh, your release here all right is silver it's black black plastic and i think this might be plastic too now that i'm playing with it i think it is it's just uh painted but you know what they want price wise for the new atomic just get the xr i just did a video on it i think it was 109 dollars with a battery and charger where they want 129 bare bones for the atomic version all right and then this is really sad and it really hurts and it hurts inside now i did a deal uh, at amazon and i know a lot of you guys took advantage of it they want 99 dollars for this right it was probably a month ago and this was 16 dollars on amazon but porter cable i don't know guys i don't know what I wish I knew somebody who worked. If anyone has a direct contact with Porter Cable, let me know, because I, I want to talk to him. I want to spend some time with him, all right, and see what's really going down with it. All right, so these are still $99. And I tell you, for $149, you can get the kits. These are great deals, guys. I don't know how long it's going to last. Uh, the three is down to 59 bucks. You know, I, I think this is going to work for DeWalt. Hopefully they come out with some more tools. I think it's been doing pretty good. This looks pretty loaded, but uh, they've probably been selling pretty good. If you remember the guy from Lowe's, I don't know. I'm sure a lot of you saw this, but the guy from Lowe's got into some trouble around three, three weeks ago. They film a Lowe's video for the employees every month. All right. And it's a really nice production that they do. And I guess Lowe's shows it to all their employees. They all sit down and they watch it. One of the their head guys made a comment, and he got into some deep water, and it was about the DeWalt 12-volt stuff. You can look it up on YouTube if you want. But I will not stand for it, so I won't mention it. All right, here. Oh, look at this. This might be the first. All right, so they kind of 
All right, this is what I want to see. Whoa, look at this. They really made this nice. All right, so here's the eight amp hour battery. How much is this? It's just sitting here. And I tell you, they do a great job with their batteries. Uh, this is the 21700 cell. And they have five bars on their battery now, which is absolutely awesome. It just gives you a better heads up of what's going on. You know, pretty soon, we're going to start having a digital gauge. I wonder who's going to come out with it first. But eventually, you're going to press a button on your battery, and it's going to say 21%. It's going to say 36%. It's going to say 58%. One day, you'll have an exact number, okay? We're going to get there. you got to calm down. All right, what is this? All right, here's the GBH... Um, 199 remember that deal's still going on guys for 249 you get the bulldog right oh this is down to 249 yeah i've never seen this light before that's why i'm kind of looking at it you got one two you got six leds in here what's up travis 94 my brother yes Dan Fuller, yes, hey man, we all have fun with it. Tell your wife, listen, you're having some fun. Hey, you're not like you're, you know, at the local pub. And you're watching the tool boss, having fun. You know? Sinan, what's up? Yeah, I don't know Porter Cable. I'd like to get in touch with them. EJM, what's up, brother? Dr. Pharma. It's, I invest in, yes, Justin Thornton. Yeah, I, it's, I'm telling you, I think Porter Cable is the one brand. You know, like, all right, I'm going to be honest with you. And you can tell me if you agree or not. No matter what Bostitch does, I think they're dead. All right? Meaning that, let's say Bostitch decides, hey, you know what? We're going to come out with a drill driver, a hammer drill. A, we're going to come out with a whole line of 18-volt tools. It's going to be brushless. Uh, I don't know. Craftsmen. We kind of know about them right they got three brushless tools but let's say they start to expand their brushless tools i don't think sbd i don't think stanley black and decker knows what they have with porter cable because i can tell you if they came out you know tomorrow hey, sbd signs um i don't know whatever sbd coming out with new porter cable brushless lines for professionals they would sell the crap like and if they really invested in it and made it you know cuz i think there's such value in that porter cable name and i don't i don't from the get go i don't think they invested right in it what they're doing with craftsmen now they could have saved 500 million dollars cuz i can tell you they bought porter cable for nothing they pretty much got it for free. They were going to go bankrupt Porter Cable. They were on the balls of their ass. But they decided to do what they should have done with Porter Cable with Craftsman. That's my opinion. They ruined it. They're ruining it. Now, Craftsman has a great name too. But I think if Porter Cable came out tomorrow and said, All right, hey, now we're back. Now here's that deal. Remember, you get this for free. And remember, this comes with a battery. So for $249, you're getting two four core batteries, okay? Two four cores. So it's going to be nice and light. It's a bulldog. It's very recip like um, you saw the video I made with the Bosch representative. Great guy. Hopefully, um, I get to meet him again at some point. I kind of don't like the whole recip look of it and the feel. I like the old school SDSs. Um, I think this might be their brushed version. But I like the shorter um, SDSs. All right? Now, um, I don't know. That's probably not even an inch. It's a three and a quarter. All right? Obviously, you wouldn't buy this. It's $199. All right? And it's a three and a quarter, and it's tool only. Obviously, for another $50, all right, you get a one inch. But I, I like this style better. But whatever you like. Oh, yeah, $79. Wow, guys, the job site radio. Look at AJM. Wow. Guys, this is the cheapest I've ever seen it. The lowest I've ever seen this for. 
And again, this is an oldie but goodie. All right. Now, I think this one's Bluetooth. I hope it is. Yeah. All right. So this has Bluetooth. You know, you don't fix what's not broken, right? I don't think they've ever come out with another radio besides this because they really really did a great job with this whole design remember you got two uh, power outlets here and you got four all right so it's a cool little unit it's loud and um 159 is the lowest i've seen it but i got these for 248 these are good these are like little portable storage things all right really that's about it yeah so 249 and this thing is really awesome and you can hook this up guys to their um, if, if you do get this, and if you have some of their corded bulldogs, this will hook up to some of their corded bulldogs too. Here's All right, good. just got to look at the recip style. And if it has kind of this recip style to it, I'm, I'm just made that because it kind of looks like a recip a little bit. Um, it'll probably work. All right, yeah. And I would get this over the eight amp hour battery because remember you still get a four with this. And this thing, man, I mean it'll suck. It'll suck like a $10 whore, man. It really does. And that's down to 179 But, and I think Bosch, you know, I would almost put Bosch into that category, I hate to say. I don't know, I don't, because Bosch have been coming out with some more brushless stuff, and it's just, I don't know. I don't know, I hope not. And this is a great, I still got to do that video, guys. This is a really good deal. Um, this is the new freak, all right? Um, you know, you can kind of tell where Bosch is going. And the, the guy said, maybe if you heard that video, I'm not going to go too nuts on it because I don't want to put words in his mouth. But I can tell you, this has more power than, than the freak, than the, the Gen 1 freak, right? It's not built as good, all right? It's built a little chintzy, all right? So I think Bosch is now and whatever i'm not going to argue it's just everyone has an opinion and you can take mine and throw it you can stuff your you can stuff your saris in a in a bag i guess i don't know about that george costanza but it seems like bosch is now obviously they just they have a great bulldog all right i just think some of their stuff they're kind of gearing towards the diy stuff now and i'm not saying all of their stuff all right, because obviously they're SDSs, they're, they're, they're jigsaws. Oh, my leg is killing me. So I wish they had a, um, I wish they had like a, a clearance. Uh, we just saw, oh, here it is. All right, so they're getting rid of this Hitachi stuff, guys. They're still trying to get rid of this. I mean, look at this, $89. Wow, you get the... the this is a great deal, guys. All right, so Hitachi Koki. All right, $89, guys. This is the kit, all right? So you're going to get that Hitachi hammer drill with a 3-amp-hour battery. Charger, brushless, $89, okay? This, and look at this. No. I did a video on this. So this is the six and a quarter. $89, guys. Oh man, that's a great deal. It's only bare tool, but still. What's great about this guys, it's it's a six and a half, but it, it almost cuts as deep as a seven and a quarter. Alright? And I think with certain cuts it's gonna be right around a seven and a quarter. So you got a six and a half um inch circular saw that kind of cuts like a seven and a quarter. Alright? Yeah, deep cut. It has a larger cut capacity than a seven and a quarter. Lighter weight, more compact. $89. Man, I want to try this. I might get that. I really might. I might do it. No, this is all brush stuff here. I wouldn't touch that. Because you can get this and this and still be under $199. Okay? You see what I'm saying? And you're going to have, yeah, you can get a three amp hour battery. This comes with a three. I don't, I don't want to get that brushed off. 169 $89 for their recip. Yeah, this is brushless too. All right, so check this out. All right, so they want $199 for this. 
All right, 199. All right, whatever, dude. Take your saris and stick them. All right, bear tool. This was 199. Very well, that's crazy. And this has a lifetime warranty, guys. So if you bust this, you're probably going to get a Metabo. But anyway, 89. 89 and 89. So what is that? You're around 279. And instead of getting these crappy 18 volt brush tools here, you're going to spend, you know, you got a brushless circular, you got your battery, a three amp hour charger, brushless hammer drill, brushless recip. Pick it up, put it in the car, and go. Yeah, I said it. You heard it. I'll tell you, I'm waiting for these to drop. I really want to get this. Um, what one did I want to get? Yeah, I think it was that one. I want to get this. And look at this. Wall charger. Again, this is all licensed stuff, guys. This isn't made by DeWalt. But, yeah. I want that. But it goes down like 10 bucks. The store's dead here, guys. I got the work pro. All right, look at this. 10 piece. I mean, 8.98. Not bad, but at Christmas time, guys, I mean, I, I bought a couple of these. They were like $2 at the end of the year. Remember? All right, 19. Wow. Was for, Check this out, guys. That's a deal. All right, everybody. Who? Yeah, 210 piece. All right, for 20 bucks. Now, listen. Ryobi kind of does something like this at Christmas, too, where they have... It's nothing great, but you have a lot of bits, all right? So, if you kind of... And this has security bits, all right? You do have the, the security bits with this. For 20 bucks, guys, I'm telling you, there's some security torque sets that you find on Amazon. They're like $12, $13, and you get like 10 bits, all right? So, what's this? Oh, oh look... Oh, oh, yeah. All right, guys, let me get the hell out of here. What am I doing? What am I doing here at this time of night? I don't know what just happened there. All right, let me, I can't, I'm leaving. All right, so everybody, you got to chill a second. If you want that cobalt set, guys, it's 149. If you really want it, Show them this video. Say, listen, can you match this price? All right? Because it's a good deal. And I hate to see that the only... I can't believe it's down to 149 All right? Oh, yeah, here's the bottom part. Oh, this is down to 169 Okay? So, if you... I'm telling you, it's $59, guys. Yeah, he's going to buy some stuff. Oh, yeah, I want to show you the Craftsman Torx. I might get this. Now, listen up here, folks. We saw the Icon, all right? I think the Icon Torque Wrench was $99. Was I, Am I right or wrong? I can't remember. I think their half inch was 9 Maybe it was more. But... Um, their half inch is 89 bucks, guys. And you get a nice little case here. I'm not saying this is, you know, better than the Icon here, but... Uh, this is a, you know, if you have that 20... The thing about Lowe's, which makes it pretty good... Oh, they got this locked up. Um, you know, you can go when sometimes they have some, you know, save 20 on 100. Or, you know, save 15% off your... You know, you use them, it, sometimes it kind of makes up the price difference compared to Depot, right? I mean, for 149 right, if you have that coupe, you know, say a $20 off 100 I mean, you're getting this for 129 bucks, guys. 129 bucks. Um, you know, I, I'm actually thinking about getting this just to put my miter saws on. If you have miter saws, you got to talk about. Um, I have a 10-inch. I have a 12 inch and I have a seven and a quarter inch. Uh, you, know, you guys, if you've been following me, I built that nice uh, bench, but I got no room for these damn freaking miter saws. They take up so much freaking room. 
But, you know, you can throw, I can throw the seven and a quarter and probably the ten on this sucker. Hopefully. I'm probably going to get just one on here, but still. So, it, it's, a, it's a pretty decent deal for 149. All right. Yeah. All right. I paid for two fifty four. Oh, you bought it, Doctor Farmer? Two fifty? Yeah. Um, Federer, my man, Federer paid three forty nine, I believe. Or he might have paid two ninety nine. I think he paid fifty dollars off. And he he went three. He went four times, and every time there was a price reduction, his lows. They they took it off. They 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 dropped it. They told him no at first. I said you got to go see a manager, man. I mean no, you just bought it under 30 days. Yeah, but I don't know. Uh, he was kind of like rough around the edges, man. I'm like get, go talk to him. Get him talk to the manager, and he ended up doing it. All right, I got to get out of here, guys. Thank you, Daniel. God bless you, Bill Allen. Cool man. Thanks for coming in tonight, man. I appreciate everybody hanging out. I'll catch you on the flip.